Welcome to day number 13 of the Helicopter 3s, and this is Friday night, Friday the 13th, and I'm going to attempt a, a major feat here to get through the three types of night without completely screwing this up. There's some of you out there that maybe you never have trouble with any of these. I, for one, have to review this all the time because I screw it up, so let's see how I can do here. Definition of night. The definition of night is... The end of evening civil twilight up to the beginning of morning civil twilight as published in the American Air Almanac, converted to local time. Boom, we got that one done. The next one is when must your aircraft position lights be on? Those have to be on sunset to sunrise. That one I can always remember. I can get through that one okay. So here goes number three. The night currency. To be current at night to take up passengers in the preceding 90 days, you had to have three takeoffs and landings in the category and class of aircraft you want to be current in for your passengers. And these three takeoffs and landings must take place an hour after sunset, an hour after sunset up until one hour before sunrise as published in the American Air Almanac. So, there you go. That was a struggle, and it's always a struggle. So for me, I don't know. I've always had trouble with that, and I have to review that all the time. But point being, my ex longtime examiner that I've been using always says, good pilot uses his resources. You can't remember every single thing. So you got to be good with the far aim, you know, be good at looking stuff up, and know where to find your answers. So, you know, if you're like me and have a little trouble remembering things sometimes, don't be afraid to grab your fire aim, grab your rotorcraft flying handbook. You know, go to that source of information where you can can get that uh, whatever it is you're looking for. So, please click the like button. I hope this helps, and we will see you on day number fourteen. Thanks. See you later.